Hello YouTube. Today I will show you how to use Wireshark to sniff packets over the internet. So while doing the experiment, none of the website is being hacked or being illegally used. It's just for practical purpose and for educational purpose only. For doing this, we will just take one random website which is not secure. So first of all, we will take this website is demo.testfire.net. So first of all, open up the Wireshark to download Wireshark. I will provide the link in description and click on local area connection because everything is done in our local area connection only. So here you can see all the packets are being captured, the type of network protocol being used UDP and everything is being captured here you can see it clearly is some of the parts which is not human readable form which is encrypted is also shown here so let's stop the packet sniffing for a while and let's move to our practical part So first of all, we will move to our website that is demo.testfire.net. So here is the website. This is basically a banking website, which is not at all secure. So let's go to the login page here. So here I am putting a login name and you can also see that all packets are getting captured. So we will just put on the packet sniffing again so that we will get new packets from this login page. So let's put any random username it's used before so i'm using some another name e dot stud and also password which is i am using you will come to know this password also afterwards so here we login so as you can see login failed here it is showing login failed so no matter login failed or successful the packets are sniffed and we can detect what is being done so in filter just put the filter as http is equal to is equal to post and hit enter So after putting filter, you can see this packets which were going on. So click on the first package. After that, we have to find out the username and password in it. So everything which was going on in the website where we visited, everything has been tracked here. So I will just show you the username and password. Just scroll down. You will see the username and password which I have used. You know the username but password which I have used. You can't see that so it will be visible now. So here comes the part. As you can see username that is t.stud and a password which I had used. So, just like this, you can use this Wireshark. Actually, the intention behind showing this is that many people say that what matters if the website is HTTPS and HTTP. Here is the thing that matters that if the SSL security is there to website, then uh, such type of packet sniffing can't be done. That is, if the site is HTTP, that is, the site is not secure. Anyone can sniff your packets and can do anything with a network and also he or she can hack your network. So 
If you like this video, just hit a like and subscribe. See you again in the next one.